In this video, I'm going to be going over mix-ups and uh, setups, mid-screen and in the corner. This character is really cheap, so I'm going to start with like the easiest one. Uh, and I've played, I've played a couple of Angies. I've only this is literally my day one Angie. I've only just started practicing with this character, uh, and um, this is one of the uh, setups that I came up with. So, yeah, you can get crazy corner carry with this. And this is, this is like straight up meaty. Like, you don't even have to think, you don't have to memorize the timing. All you have to do is get this down. Just, just this. Just, um, so this is down kick into down, uh, what is it called? Dust? Yeah, down dust into the Rekka and into the dash after the Rekka. And that's meaty. Like, if, if you just go straight into this, like, again, that's meaty. Like, like, they, there's no no wake up grab or anything like that like you just you just meaty that's that's only the first step that's mid screen there's also some stuff he can do with some roman cancels mid screen i'm going to save the corner stuff for last so now i'm going to go into the mid screen stuff All right, so that's some mid-screen Roman cancel stuff. Um, it's pretty crazy. Uh, my stuff specifically is optimized for like corner carry. Um, I'm sure there's more stuff you could do mid-screen with Anji. Like uh, this is only scratching the surface. Okay, so moving on to corner setups. This one um, that I'll start off with is very gimmicky. This can be jumped out of, but I mean, if you're just gonna bully, if you wanna bully a beginner, this this setup works it's just and you cancel in a bird that can catch somebody off guard <clears throat> if they're not expecting it um but if you've been if you've been conditioning your opponent a lot with this i mean oops if you've been conditioning your opponent a lot with this they're gonna be um well not the grab specifically but but just just this in general because you can meet you get to get a meter off that they're not always going to be prepared. I mean, unless you're going against somebody really, really good. They're not going to be uh, always prepared for this. And in, into that, obviously, you, you, you're plus. Um, and I always recommend that you check, check them while the bird part is coming out with a standing slash or kick or something to at least condition them from dashing out that way because because if they're really crazy they they'll just try to hit you out of it and you don't want that to happen especially against a character like soul who will make you explode but i wouldn't really recommend using that setup anyway especially when you can just you know do that but that's an option the mid-screen setup i showed off is also very good in the corner as well you can basically just do the exact same thing, uh, except they have their back to the corner, so they can't hope their 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 uh, their movement options are like very restricted in the corner. So doing this is very scary in the corner. This Roman cancel setup. So obviously, you know, you can go double overhead, or you can go overhead low which is you know really good like really good 
that's basically the mix by the way just overhead low and and i by the way i recommend using um after this the roman cancel because obviously you have a bunch of jump buttons um that uh the the heavy slash air button is his best option because that will hit, hit a crouching opponent uh standing i mean not standing jumping slash won't always hit a crouching opponent it's very inconsistent so is uh jumping kick jumping jumping punch can hit a crouching opponent but it's really hard to get a combo off that so i would really recommend using that um jumping this this is this is jumping dust that's also not a great option so yeah this is gonna be your go-to usually i mean if, if you want to just go overhead low that's your best option but if you want to go overhead overhead and you think that they're going to stand and respect the first overhead uh which is this which um you can't air dash at this, of course, but people usually aren't going to be able to distinguish between this, which you can dash, and this also, which you can dash cancel. Because you can you can j dash cancel, jump kick, and um, jump slash, but you cannot dash cancel, jump heavy slash. People aren't going to usually be able to visually distinguish that. It's like happening way too fast, so. You know, if you're going single overhead, go keep, go with this to at least condition them to stand um, it, at first, and then you know, after you condition the stand, you can go double overhead. That's basically all I got. Uh, hopefully, this is a short video. Um, I'm going to end up having more stuff. Um, obviously, you can. You know, these are just like setups, but obviously as his Rekka's to do basic mix-ups. But I wouldn't recommend always relying on that, especially if you have meter, because after a while, when someone gets used to playing you and you're just like going autopilot, like, ooh, Rekka, Rekka low, Rekka overhead, the overhead is kind of slow, so, I mean, that's pretty fuzzy blockable. I wouldn't recommend going uh, autopilot with the Rekka because at a higher level you're gonna get figured out. So don't 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 go with autopilot. Anyway, 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 that's the end of the video. Let me know if you want a combo video or whatever else for this character because I will be labbing this character more and more because he's caught my interest as a character with like a you know a parry or whatever whatever this is considered. I think people call it guard point. Yeah. Anyway, yeah, that's that's enough of that. Uh oh, I just remembered I forgot to show something off. I hope nobody clicked off the video thinking it was over because it, it's not over. If you have meter, there's also um something involving his super. And you know, you might be wondering what what's what's so great about the uh you know why would I why would I do a, a super setup because you need to um god damn it you need to use a bunch of meter you need to use literally all your meter uh but you know this is something that I've figured out like as a ram player because I like to do super into Roman cancel a lot if you just let's let's just do slash slash in the super and then we dash so that's like 145 damage into a into a hard knockdown into a positive bonus oh uh, and ob obviously so your options from that are low as I've already shown off um, you can do dust which is a little slower there's also I mean if you really want to mind fuck someone you can go into you could go into you know Rekka and 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 do another setup off of that and uh you can also something I haven't tested out which is 
I'll test this out right now, actually. Okay, so yeah. So if you're if you're like hugging your opponent and close slash and jump. You can you can get like a little fuzzy setup. Uh which actually looks ridiculous now that I think about it. Actually, you know what? If you get a knockdown. I wonder if well, that'll combo, actually. That's not what I want. That's not what I want. Okay, that pushes you too far. So, optimally, what you want with this setup is to be as close as possible when you're supering and make them block. You want them to block the super. You up Roman cancel. God damn it. You, like, I... <sighs> Inputs are sloppy. I'll cut to when I actually am able to do this this little setup that I literally just made up. There it is. So yeah, as you can see, you can get a ridiculous mix-up off of that, which is kind of insane. Um, I haven't fleshed this out, but. Um, you can probably fake a low there. It's kind of it's, it's kind of hard to see there. Uh, you saw it did like an insanely hard to react to, like dash. Like you, you're not reacting to that. And if they get hit, obviously, in the corner, they uh, get a uh, wall break, hard knockdown. Um, and I haven't even tested out any hard knockdown setups. And you get one to positive bonus. You you can corner carry. So yeah, that's. Just a little bonus with his super that I just figured out. Um, that probably needs to be fleshed out more, but hope any Anji players enjoyed that. Alright, uh, thank you for watching, and please like the video.